हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू माई चैनल टू पॉलिश यू सी एस सी कंसेप्ट विथ मी सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट अल्फा बीटा प्रोनिंग सो वॉट इज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू शूड नो दैट वॉट इज द रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ दिस अल्फा बीटा प्रोनिंग इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव डिस्कस्ड मिन मैक्स अलगोरिदम राइट सो वॉट वॉज द डिसएडवाटेज ऑफ मिन मैक्स अलगोरिदम दैट इन मिन मैक्स अलगोरिदम वी वी हैड टू ट्रावर्स ईच एंड एवरी नोड ऑफ द गिवन ट्री but in case of alpha beta pruning we are going to traverse only to those nodes that are required what does this alpha beta pruning what does this pruning means prune means to cut off so in this what we will do we will simply cut off the branch that is not required fine with the help of example you will get a clear idea so in case there was the problem of time consuming much more time was consumed in min max algorithm and so this alpha beta pruning technique came into the existence fine so let's see with the help of example how to solve this alpha beta pruning so the main condition in alpha beta pruning is as the name itself indicates we are going to prune the unnecessary branches so how to do it with the help of this condition so you need to remember this condition that whenever alpha will be greater than or equal to beta we are going to prune that branch simple as that so you need to remember this condition fine okay now uh, what is alpha and beta in alpha beta pruning alpha means alpha will denote the max and beta will denote the min and the default value we, um, you must be knowing we have discussed this in uh, min max algorithm also that in alpha the uh, alpha means max and the default value of alpha is minus infinity and the default value of beta is infinity fine so these are the basic things now we have see, uh, taken this standard example let's see how to solve it now Uh, remember that in order to solve this with the help of alpha beta pruning we will be traversing the graph by depth first search kind of we will use dfs to solve this whole example like we will go in the depth and then we will go like this fine this is how we are going to traverse it so let's start solving the example now for root we will take the default values what are the default values alpha is equal to minus infinity and beta is equal to infinity these are the default values we have given them to root now as we know the bottom or the children nodes can take the values from the parent node so this alpha and beta values that are already present in the root will be transferred um, downwards so here also we will get alpha equal to minus infinity and beta equal to infinity fine similarly here also this will be transferred here also so alpha equal to minus infinity beta equal to infinity here also alpha equal to minus infinity beta equal to infinity okay now we are coming here fine we are going depth wise so after this we are coming here here the value of this node is given as 10 these root values are already given don't worry about that fine so this value is given as 10 now this level is for min this is max right as we know we are having min and max alternatively so this is min this is max this is min and again this is max now we have reached here here the value of this node is 10 so now after this because how we are traversing like this and again like this right so after this after this 10 we are again going here here which value we have to update see in min level we will only update min min means what beta so in min level we will update only beta and in the max level we will update only alpha do remember that fine okay now after here we are again going here here it is min so we will only we can only update the beta value now beta value equal to infinity now uh, we have to update the minimum value now out of infinity and 10 which is minimum the minimum value is 10 so we will update the value of beta and 10 will come fine so after this node we are again going to this node just follow dfs depth, depth first search fine so after this we are again going here now we are having 5 so this 5 we will take it here now again we have to compare this is mean we have to compare beta so the beta value is 10 till now now what is the minimum value from 10 and 5 out of 10 and 5 what is minimum 5 so again it will be updated and it will give the value 5 fine so the updated value of alpha is minus infinity here beta is 5 here fine 
so after this again we will go to top here this value this level is of max so we we will update the value of alpha now we will compare we will uh, update the value of alpha with the maximum value so what is the maximum value out of minus infinity minus infinity and 5 out of this 3 minus infinity minus infinity and 5 what is the maximum value of 5 so this will be updated as 5 fine now we will come here here it is the child node so this alpha and beta value will be copied so alpha will come here as 5 and beta will come here as infinity fine okay now after this node we will okay now after here we are going here here the value is 7 so here we have to in this le level we have to update this min value that is beta out of infinity and 7 what is minimum 7 so this beta value will be updated by 7 fine now again we will come here here we have updated this with 7 now again we will come here in this value this is the max value that is alpha will be updated so out of 5 5 and 7 what is the maximum value 7 so this will be updated as 7 getting you just have to follow dfs and you have to take care that what should be updated okay so we are here the value of updated value of alpha is 7 and beta is infinity fine now again we will go to again after after see we have traversed like this and after this we will again go here here it is min so we will update beta the value of beta is infinity here so out of infinity and infinity here infinity 7 are there so out of infinity 7 and infinity what is minimum 7 so this will be updated as 7 fine so after this we will again go here here these values will be copied so alpha equal to minus infinity and beta equal to 7 See, it is very simple. You just go on following the steps. It is very simple. Fine. So, these values are like this here. Okay. Um, fine. Alpha equal to, we just have copied this, that alpha equal to minus infinity, beta equal to 7. Now, again, after this node, we are coming here. This will be, the same will be copied here, beta equal to 7. Now, here the value we are having is 12. Now, this is min. So, we will update beta. Now, out of 7 and 12, what is minimum? 7 is minimum. So, it will be as it is. Now, here. Out of 8 and 7, what is minimum? 7 is minimum. So, it will be as it is. Fine. Now, we will go top. This is max. So, alpha will be updated. So, now, out of minus infinity, minus infinity and 7, what is maximum? 7 is maximum. So, this 7 will be updated here. Okay. Okay. Now, okay, yes, see, here alpha equal to 7 and beta equal to 7. Now, at every node, you have to go on checking this condition. In all these nodes, this condition was not true. But in this case, the condition alpha is greater than or equal to beta is true because both are same, means equal to alpha is greater than or equal to beta, yes. 7 is greater than or equal to 7, yes, because 7 is equal to 7. So, this condition is correct. Whenever this condition is correct, we have to prune the... Uh, further branch so here 7 is greater than or 7 7 is greater than or equal to 7 this condition this condition is true so here we will prune we are not going to check further so here one pruning is done here fine so without going further we will simply we will simply go upward like this out of this is not there so now we will go top now here it is min that is beta um, min means beta will be updated so out of 7 7 7 all the three values are same so we need not to update it now this whole thing is completed right so after that we will go here here it is max so alpha will be updated so out of minus infinity minus infinity and 7 which is the maximum value 7 so this will be updated by the value 7 fine so after that we are coming here so here obviously this value will be carry forwarded so alpha equal to 7 and beta equal to infinity fine okay now the same value will be forwarded here alpha equal to 7 beta equal to infinity the same will be here alpha equal to 7 beta equal to infinity now here the value is 5 here this is min value means beta will be updated so out of infinity and 5 which is the smaller value 5 now here out of 5 and 12 which is the smaller value 5 so the final value is 5 now after that we will go here here it is max so alpha will be updated so out of 7 7 and 5 what is the maximum value 7 so it will be as it is we are not going to do anything mm. 
ओके होल्ड ऑन यस वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू डू एनी थिंग बिकॉज आउट ऑफ सेवन सेवन एंड फाइव सेवन is the maximum value so it will be as it is now after this we are going here here the value will be carry forwarded so alpha equal to 7 beta equal to infinity now here 11 here this is min so beta will be updated so out of infinity and 11 which is smaller 11 so it will be 11 now again out of 11 and 12 which is smaller 11 is smaller so it will be as it is so the updated value of beta is 11 fine okay now Uh, now we will traverse to this node. Here it is max, so alpha will be updated. So out of seven, seven, eleven, which is the biggest value, eleven. So this will be updated as eleven. Fine. Now again we are here. It is min value, so beta will be updated. So out of infinity, eleven, infinity, which is the smallest value, eleven. So this alpha will be updated to eleven. Fine. So after this we will be coming here. Here the value will be carry forwarded. So alpha equal to seven, beta equal to eleven. Again here also alpha equal to seven, beta equal to eleven. And now here we are having after there after this we are here at this node nine. Now again this is min means beta will be updated. So out of eleven and nine which is the smaller value nine. So nine. Now again here out of nine and eight which is the smaller value eight. So again it will be updated as eight. Fine. Now after this we will come here. Um, here it is max, so alpha will be updated. Now out of seven, seven and eight, which is the maximum value eight, so seven will be updated with the new value eight. Now after this we are here, so this value will be carry forwarded here. So alpha equal to eight and beta equal to eleven. Now we are at this node. This node is seven. Now this is min, so beta will be updated. Now out of seven and eleven, which is the smaller value seven, so this will be updated by seven. Now here, out of seven and ten, which is the smaller value seven, so this seven will be as it is. Uh, now this small uh, this seven will be as it is. Okay, here again, if you see that alpha is greater than or equal to beta, so there was no need to check. We can simply prune it. Alpha is greater than or equal to beta, right? So here also it was there. Now if I check, see alpha is okay. This is fine. This is fine. Whenever alpha is greater than or equal to beta, you need to prune it. Fine. so this is the way this is your updated tree these are the values of each and every node that we have found out and the simple thing you have to remember is what to do in min and what to do in max and the second important thing is you have to remember that we are going in dfs if you um, follow the sequence properly then you will not go wrong many students are finding this topic to be quite tough but if you follow the sequence it is actually easy i hope you have understood the whole example at the whole concept easily in case you still have any doubt you can always ask in the comment section thank you so much